potential energy and its forms. In our earlier session, we have learnt about kinetic energy and its forms. In our present session, let us learn about potential energy. Potential energy is one of the types of mechanical energy. Potential energy is type of stored energy. Potential energy is the energy possessed by a body to do work by virtue of its position or state of strain or state of configuration. In definition, potential energy is defined as the energy possessed by a body by virtue of its state. The unit of potential energy is kilograms meters. Forms of potential energy there are different forms of potential energy. 1. Chemical potential energy. 2. Nuclear potential energy. 3. Gravitational potential energy. 4. Elastic potential energy. Chemical potential energy. The energy is in the form of chemical energy, which is stored in the bonds between the atoms. When the bonds are broken, the stored energy is released and absorbed and new bonds are formed. Nuclear energy Nuclear energy is another stored form of potential energy in the nucleus. The fusion of atoms or split of atoms through a reaction is called as nuclear reaction. In nuclear reaction, if atoms split into new atoms, then it is called as nuclear fission. In nuclear reaction, if atoms join together to form new kind of atoms, is called as nuclear fusion. Gravitational potential theory. Gravitational energy is another form of potential energy. Any energy that is used to work against the gravitation is called gravitational energy. For example, when we lift an object away from the ground, the energy that is gained by the object is said to be as gravitational potential energy. If we drop the object towards the ground, then potential energy turns into kinetic energy. Elastic potential theory. Elastic energy is a form of stored potential energy. Elastic energy is stored in compressed gas or compressed liquid a coil spring or stretched elastic band. The elastic energy is irreversible present on the bonds between the atoms. When the bonds are stressed, the energy is absorbed. When the bonds are released, the energy is released. 